Greetings. So later this month, I'm giving my Capo Kids workshop. It's on June 27th and 28th. And uh, you can find out information on it on my website. And in light of all that's been happening uh, these recent days and the intensity of the protests in uh, Philadelphia, I've decided to donate 20% of the money to the Philadelphia Bail Fund. Okay, and so, and I also decided to uh, give you a series of poems this month, kind of leading up to the workshop that are you know, celebrating different aspects of Hatha Yoga. Okay, so here's the latest installment. And so, do your practice, do your practice for mental strength, okay? Physical strength is nothing compared to mental, psychological, emotional strength. To go through or experience physical fear is nothing compared to facing the hidden terrors in your mind. Okay? The, the internal fears, inadequacy, failure. So what does it mean to be mentally strong? And it's to, to face your mind, to continue to look within when you don't want to, to feel and listen as well. And it, instead of responding with lightning quick habit, lightning quick entrenched habit, mental strength requires that I acknowledge when I'm angry, jealous, lustful, fearful, or biased, or unfair. And mental weakness is to ignore these emotions or stances to pretend that I'm not experiencing them. Mental strength means that I can come into different relationship with my self-critiques and judgments. I can step back, refrain from harassing, haranguing, belittling, or otherwise attempting to chop myself down. Also, I can remain present in the face of my own self-perception and self-discernment. I am open to constant correction and seeing my mistakes. Okay, I can judge and assess my thoughts, intentions, and behaviors. I can admit it when I'm wrong. Strength means Mental strength means I can enter and so mental strength means I can enter into a relationship with others under the, the same healthy working terms that I've come to within myself. Okay? I can have relationships based on respect, honesty, genuine regard, love and independence rather than based on neediness, dependence or fear. Mental strength means having the ability to direct my energy, will, and consciousness towards what has value to me. And it is through mind power that I find the courage to follow wherever the secret source of all love leads me. So do your practice for mental strength. Do your practice for mental strength. 